What do you think happened in Chernobyl? What lessons do we learn from Chernobyl nuclear disaster and maybe also Three Mile Island and uh, Fukushima accidents? I think you're suggesting that it has to do with the humans a bit. So with Chernobyl and Fukushima, I actually put Three Mile Island in a different category. In fact, um, some of the recent news in the last year is that we're going to be restarting Three Mile Island because there's such a need for clean baseload power. So that's that's actually a very interesting other topic we should talk about is, is why and, and how we're doing that. But more than that, going back to the accidents that did happen, um, in both of those systems, you can point to the human failure rather than the engineering failures of those systems. That in Fukushima specifically, there were multiple nuclear fission reactors on the same site that successfully kept running through the tsunami, totally successfully, and were only later shut down for more political reasons. But the old one, the oldest of them that had been on site for for long periods and maybe maybe too long, I think some experts have looked at this in the past, um, was where the, the some of the problems actually happened. And so I look to that less as a um, a failure of the engineering of the power plants and more of the humans and around those systems that if we that we should be operating these plants as designed, and and then I believe they're safe. And that gets to some of the atomic weapons questions that I think are the other part around nuclear reactors and fission reactors that are concerning for me. 